Please stand for the Pledge of, Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, and you may now be seated. Please pause for a moment of silence. Good morning, Echo Eagles. Welcome to Eagles News, keeping you up today on all Echo Things. I'm your announcer today, Arlenis. And I'm Riley. Today is November 10th. Today is City 2, you have blocks 5, 6, 7, and 8. Today, the weather will be more clouds than sun. We reach the high of 72 degrees and a low of 60 degrees. The lunch choices today will be ham and cheese chef salad, Asian chicken brown rice, or a healthy day meal. For gym and PE this week, Mr. Miles and Ms. Sports will be in the gym. Ms. Thomas and Ms. Jenkins will be in the classroom. In November, we celebrate the diverse cultures, tradition, histories, and contributions of Native Americans. Today, we feature Senator Ben Nighthorse Campbell, the first Native American elected to the United States Senate and the chief of the Northern Cheyenne Nation. Senator Ben Nighthorse Campbell has done it all. He served in the Korean War and represented the United States on the Olympic judo team. After he retired from politics, he became an award-winning jewelry designer. Check out your Schoology Updates page for, to learn more about him. Are you looking to join a club that promotes inclusions and rights for all students? If this sounds like you, no place for hate welcomes you. Please complete an interest form by scanning the QR code on the bright yellow flyers in the hallway. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Flowers in school counseling. The Fall Scholastic Book Fair is here. Visit the library through Friday, November 11th and check out all the great new books, pens, and posters. We will be open tonight during parent conferences. Tomorrow is the last day to buy in person. You can also buy online through November 17th. Look on the Library Schoology page for more information. Congrats on the football team who won against Holman last night, 22 to 14. Did you know that winter sports will start off in a few days? Anyone interested in trying out should get an updated physical soon. Boys basketball tryouts will be by grade level, 8th grade on November 14th, 7th grade on November 15th, 6th grade on November 16th. On November 17th, students that made the cut will have their final day of trials. November 18th will be their first day of basketball practice. For wrestling, all grade levels will try out together starting November 14th. For, for all sports tryouts, athletes must have a current physical on file. It has to be dated on or after May 1st, 2022. Open Gym for Basketball is available for boys on November 9th and 10th from 3.30 to 5, but it does not affect tryouts and is no, in no way attached to tryouts. Students must have a permission slip signed to stay after. Get your permission slips from the office and when filled out, please return them back to the office. Elko PTSA is also collect, is collecting gently used athletic shoes. Please put the shoes for donation in the black box to the right of the library door. Elko is also collecting canned and other non perishable food items for the Christmas mother. Bring in the items for donation to your advisory class. Today in advisory, everyone will be working on second step. Mark your calendars. The block party from the world's finest chocolate fundraiser will be on Tuesday, November 22nd. If you still have money to turn in, please bring that to Mrs. Cox and she is in the hall by the elevator in the mornings. Any students who has not returned their money from the World Finest Chocolate Fundraiser will not be able to attend the block party. Now Mrs. Meeks, now Mrs. Meeks is here to announce the positive referrals. We did that yesterday. Thanks for listening. And remember, we are Elko Excellence. We have Elko Pride. I am positive. I am responsible. I have integrity. I am disciplined. I am engaged. We, we will soar. soar. Have a good day.